Hey guys, welcome back to Wooden Shield Games, and today we're going to continue on with Spyro the Dragon Part 2. So, where we last left off, I've already entered Stone Hill, and um, we're collecting gems and, of course, finding all the missing dragons. Um, let's see. You know what? I just realized in this playthrough, playthrough I have not gotten damaged or hurt. So, uh, hashtag perfect playthrough, hashtag no damage. <laughs> so let's continue right where we left off. Now, there's this little critter who has the egg that I need to retrieve and chase and basically knock him down. And actually, I was looking for this, a way up, because he's up there. I'll knock down that little bastard. And I think I found myself the last dragon, and I only have a few gems left. So here we go. I rescued Gildas. Okay, he's a painter. How about a hint on gliding? You bet! For the longest glide, press the jump button at the top of your jump, and try pressing the action button to drop down mid-flight. The action button's a triangle button, by the way. So, um, here we go. Mid-flight, stop. Okay, the little critter's over there, somewhere. He has the egg. I have to go get him. Um, where is it? Okay, little bastards over there, so I have to go get them. Let's go. He's real fast. I hate him. I forgot what they're called, but just know that I hate him. And I burned his ass. Got him. All right, collected the egg. Now just to find all the gems, and I'm done with Stone Hill. I've already perfected it. And all the gems are spread out here. They turn to cotton when you ch when you chase these sheep. Boing, 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 boing. Bam. Done. Gone. Obliterated. Destroyed. All right. This place is a little tricky, but beyond these barriers, you can't pass it because it's an invisible wall, which is pretty cool looking. Uh, here we go. Okay, how many? 149. Okay, I need like about 41, uh, no, 31 to go. The value. 31 gems. I just want to make sure I got everything here. Okay, can't go that way. Okay, now there's some around this little palace looking area right here. I know that. And there's some in that metal treasure chest from earlier. Can't you, okay, that's non-accessible. That path. There's a key around here, too. Okay, that's from the beginning. I know there's a key around here. 159. The, you know, um, that little treasure chest I found in the beginning of the stage. From the well. Um, I have to find that key so I can unlock it, because that is where the rest of the gems are stored. Here, I missed this one. Okay, that's 164. So the rest of the one, uh, the rest of the 26 are left. See what I mean by tight corners and behind pillars and walls and, and everything? You never know, like if you've missed one, you know. I just love getting this stuff. Right, let's see. Oh, that scared me for a second. Jesus, where is it? I may have to like, not cut it, but like, ah, oh, there you are. <laughs> Too long, perfect, I found it, 200 percent of it. Or, 200 treasure. Totally, you see how it's easy to miss? Anyways, I'm going back home. That's it, I'm out. Just in time. So... I probably have to fast forward it just to save like about an extra four minutes. So we're going to go back home and then go enter another world. All right. So we're back home. 
Seriously, more gems? They didn't already collect all the gems. Alright, so you got these orbs. And if you collect all the orbs, you gain an extra life. So if there's no more gems to collect in this world, um, the villains would just have orbs for you to collect. Uh, come here. There you go. Orbs. In the very first stages of any spiral game, the villains are afraid of you. But like, if, when, when you proceed to other stages, they're not afraid of you anymore. There you go. So I have to complete that ring of warbs around my little avatar head right there in the top right corner where my life is displayed. So, I got about a good five and a half minutes to do this stage. By then, I would be already be playing for like 20 minutes or so. 20 something minutes because of like the uh, time I was using to like find those last three gems. Alright, let's go on. Oh, I like this stage a lot. It's actually one of the most memorable ones also from like the earlier uh, versions. The, um, the very first versions of this game. I remember playing this one. I hated the bulls in this one. Well, you don't have to burn them. <laughs> Welcome to Town Square, Spyro. Town Square. Exploring by gliding to that area with the bulls. Use the right stick to get a good look. Use the right stick to get a good look. I don't know. They make a scary sound. Alright. That's an interesting one right there. Awesome. Oh, crap! Okay, I, I didn't die. I got damaged. So, um, Sparks is probably blue. <laughs> so I'm going to continue right where I got, where I left off. I hate it when that happens. I didn't even see myself taking off from that platform. Like, I didn't see that fall. Alright, so they're not gems anymore. They're orbs. Devlin. Interesting name. Devlin. Thanks, Spyro. <laughs> I had the worst itch on the tip of my wing. Did you know that you get your longest glides by pressing the jump button at the very top of your jump? Huh. Thanks, man. Alright, two more dragons and an egg. So I got Nils and Devlin. And you hear him in the distance laughing. Nah, 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 nah. Yeah, I get it. You think I can't catch you? I think I did lose that life. Just eliminate them all. One, two, three. I thought I collected more treasure than that. <laughs> Spyro, do you see a man dressed in blue running around here? He's a thief. That kebab looks really good. You've got to track him down and, and get that egg. Run, run. <laughs> you mean that thing that stole the egg is a man? It looks like a little creature, like a little critter or something like a little gremlin I don't know ah see that was easy to miss right there so I need 200 gem uh, treasure for this one all right this one requires like a special glide because like there's a platform to glide right here oh damn it I right, I remember this one <laughs> 
This is a very weird one right here. At the top of my glide, right there. He's here, the bastard. The one that stole the egg. Look, that's a runway. Shit! Well, I went ahead and used the S-bomb there. Ah! Come okay, that's where my frustration starts to come in. You know. <laughs> I used to play this as a kid all the time. Come on, I perfected that jump on like the first try the last time. God, you should see me playing like multiplayer games at like FPS. You think I get frustrated this easily? Dude, you have no idea. Like, I'm war I'm terrible at Fortnite and Apex Legends. Put the bastard was here, man. Well, oh, I guess I'll reach him in a, in a minute. There, okay. Thor? This guy is Thor? Thank you for releasing me, Spyro. You can always check your progress by accessing the guidebook in the pause menu. Okay, all dragons found. Now I gotta find the. Okay, that was worth ten. Where, where was the dude? Anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and end it here. Uh, until next time, we're gonna go ahead and find the egg thief. Anyways, guys, thank you all so much for watching. Please be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and click on bell notifications. And I will see you all in the next video. Later.